Biotechnology is going to be the technology and the opportunity for the 21st century and South Africa absolutely needs to harness its capabilities and its technologies and its drive for creating social impact with biotechnology. We're in the new global machine age where technology is king. That requires the absorption through foreign direct investment of technologies and their diffusion across the manufacturing sector. But very importantly, it also requires research and development. The National Development Plan is looking at a growth target of more than 5% per year. In order for us to do that, government and the private sector need to work much more closely together around innovation and using technology for growth and development. As part of that work, the CSR is a crucial partner because they, their work is to support industry development as part of their broader mandate. We need to think differently. We therefore need to start saying, can we enter new areas of activity, such as adding value in order that we can create jobs. It's ultimately underpinned by specialized knowledge. The bioeconomy strategy speaks of three very important pillars of R&D, that is the health sector, agriculture, industry and the environment. As CSR Biosciences, we play a role in each of these areas. And what the BIDC program enables us to do is to package our know-how and proprietary technologies under this program and avail it to the broader NSI. The BIDC will ensure that there is strategic alignment within the various projects in the country. It will ensure that we find better synergies and harmonize most of the processes. So in that way, it, I think the national system of innovation within biosciences will become a much more effective engine for economic growth. Our mandate is essentially about utilizing public funds to share risk and catalyze innovation that stimulates the creation of new jobs in the economy. The fund does this by collaborating or partnering with institutions that are experts in their chosen field and have a proven implementation record. The CSIR and its partners represents a positive collaboration for the Jobs Fund. The CSIR is striving to make a difference in people's lives by taking technologies that we develop in the lab into the market to make real impact. The BIDC is one of those programs where we have developed capability to do prototyping, piloting and pre-commercial manufacture of bio-based technologies that can get products into market and make a real difference. We have to create job opportunities. And for industry to create job opportunities, they have to grow, they have to be sustainable and they have to be competitive. In the first phase of the BRDC program, we focused on providing uh, technology incubation support to SMMEs. To date, we've had over 100 applications uh, from different SMMEs for support. And to us, I think it validates that there is a demand for the support in translating research and development into product. The SMMEs that we are supporting are active in a range of market sector, including the cosmetic sector, the chemical sector, the biotechnology sector, the water and sanitation sector, amongst others. The BRDC has assisted us in terms of developing new products and technologies which have allowed us to access new channels to market for our business. As an entrepreneur, the BRDC has helped me because I've, I've already attended trainings which assisted me in terms of understanding the industry that I'm in, especially when coming to mixing the chemicals, things like contamination, things like quality standards. So that's how they assisted me and that's really important when manufacturing products. At the moment, I'm generating uh, more income uh, because of the CSIR. The name itself, you know, it boosted the, the product image as well. So the good thing with this program is that it has assisted me understand and realize that there, there is a possibility, you know, to start up a business from the validation results that they've given me. The support that we have received from the CSIR provides us with market credibility, but also it gives us the scientific validation that is necessary for us to enter this very exclusive industry, allowing us an opportunity to compete with the best in the world. 
In addition to the support we provide to SMME, we believe we have a very important role to play in developing skills for the biomanufacturing sector. To that end, we've established a year-long internship program um, and we uh, train up to 25 interns a year, allowing them to get hands-on experiential training in process development, in product development, and actually operating the machinery and the equipment required in the sector. What we're focusing on is developing human capacity. And you might have heard the phrase, technology works on two legs. So what we really are focusing here on is the fact that you might have all the facilities in the world, how good they might be, but unless you do have people that are going to operate them, you are not going to make it. So what we're really looking at with this capacity is that they are going to be the ones that are going to be running various processes manufacturing-wise in both newer and existing enterprises. So that's really our main focus through the BIDC. You will learn a lot. You will come out of it a better scientist. And I'm actually motivated to actually, you know, going forward and um, start my own uh, SMME. Seeing science being translated to real or everyday use products um, which are answering a need to the community is very exciting and beautiful. The BIDC program has assisted me as a chemical engineering technician to learn more about technology development and product development and that skill has assisted me in finding employment in one of the incubated enterprises at CSR. Every South African's daily life, science and technology is in your eyes. We had ideas that work. This for us is science that work for industry and to make the country competitive.